guys and welcome back to another video. I know I haven't posted in such a long time, but I just wanted to make this post because I've been waiting to do a bunch of videos and I'm just making a whole entire collab. So, and as you guys know, it's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus. Because Hocus, po Hocus is out and Hocus Pocus is out. Well, Hocus Pocus 2 is out, and everybody knows it's new. And, uh, everybody knows that's new and trendy. So, I just want to make some theories and just some things that I have noticed. So, I know at the ending it's a happy ending, and um, and Binks meets Emily. Well, um, sees Emily again, and. And also that he he meets uh, Danny, I think it was. Yeah, Danny. If you haven't watched Hocus Pocus, I recommend you go and watch it. And today, if you're wondering what I'm eating, I'm actually eating roasted pumpkin seeds because we never cover pumpkin without without watching Hocus Pocus in my family. Stop trouble. Um, and I just want to say, like, since that happened... And the new Hocus Pocus, don't worry, I'm not saying any spoilers, I'm just saying what I heard, um, off of, off of, like, the description. The three high school students in Salem, like, so if you read the description for the movie, the whole, um, so it says, it's up to these three high school students. And I don't understand that, because why would there be three high school students and not the original characters? So I'm wondering what happened to the original characters. Why is it just three high school students? How uh, do the witches get back alive? Those are some of my questions for you, Disney. <laughs> Thought you ever see this video, but I'm just saying, dude. And I know a lot of my of my last videos, like all of my videos are kind of weird, like the ones that said Kit and Constant Candy original me. Um, that was just because I was kind of experimenting with it. Yeah, I was like experimenting, experimenting with it and what I could do and what I couldn't do. So I hope you guys enjoyed like what I was saying and like see if you can relate um those are just some questions i have and um some of the videos i've been wanting to make like can't get them off the top of my head but like a few of them a few of my plans were like um so i'm gonna make this video blah 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 blah, blah. and then like Sorry, I'm trying to, like, get on my phone. Um, so, um, actually, I, if you didn't know, well, unless you're my family, of course, my friends. So, over the past year, it's been really fun, but there have been some ups and downs. One of those ups and downs are my bully, uh, my best friends is an up. So, like, the two new kids at my school, Helen and Ev Evie, shout out to them. I love you guys so much and cannot wait to have a play day with you. So, and also, like, I've started doing Taekwondo, and, if, and on Thursday, I broke a very hard board. I'm pretty sure the wood is still in my car, but... I'll do a video on that showing that I actually did. It was really fun. I loved it. It was just like, pow. Because it was the really hard to break board. And on the first time when I tried to break the easy board, it took a li little while because like I kept kicking like just with the flat of my foot. I didn't use my heel. Now that's what you're wanting. That's what you're going to want to do to break a really hard board. Where I foot, too. And when I did it, I, like, it was really fun because, like, he was just, like, like, my Taekwondo teacher was just, like, 
He was so confused, but he was also really happy for me. And he just was like, wow, I did not expect that. And I was like, I didn't either. Because I thought it would take a few tries, but that's just some of the news on me. And if you go to Montrose School, like, unless you're in third or fifth grade, I probably know you. Like, in your, in fourth grade, um, yeah. And you're in four, if you're in fourth grade or in my Taekwondo class, I know a lot of you. And shout out to all of my CHG friends still watching. I love you guys. And I'm really sad I had to go. But I know I definitely will make things better and make a comeback. I just wanted to say that because I've always been wanting to. And I just love you guys so much and I'm going to miss you. And I just hope that I'll be able to see you again. And if you see me, all my CSG friends, listen right now. Especially you, are I know you're watching. I know you're watching. Um, make sure to like the video if you want to. Or subscribe if you already haven't. And, and like, dang, I forgot what I was going to say. Um, but I am unicorn fan forever, guys. And, um, like, I just wanted to say that, like, if I do see you, like, at the Bexley pool or something, you are going to expect me asking for your phone number so I can get to know y'all. Well, no, not like that. No, no, no. No, I'm saying, like, not so I can get to know you, but just so I can, like, not... Just fans who watch my YouTube channel. No, no, no. Sorry. Um, but I am going to be like focusing around like my friends at CSG because I haven't been there in a while. So, yeah. And um, like I haven't been there in a while, and I will get your guys' phone numbers just so you know, so I'm able to contact you, and so you're able to give me. Everybody else's phone number. So yeah. Um and Ava, if you're watching this It's sugar. Go to It's Sugar. Um, there's a lot more candies there and it's really cool. I know you probably still go there, but just wanted to shout out to you because I missed you and I haven't seen you in a while. So if you guys play Roblox, um, like, if you guys play Roblox, then play Adopt Me, and, um, like, play Adopt Me, and you might see me. I'm not seeing my username, though, because of hacking and username stealing purposes, but, <laughs> um, I really, really, really love it when um i can just see you guys and all right that was the end of the shout out for all my csg friends um like i'm on to my theories about hocus pocus so like all my questions are like stored here i don't expect to get any answers because theories but Five nights at Freddy's, is this where you wanna be? I just don't get it. What do you want to stay? Five nights at Freddy's, is this where you wanna be? I just don't get it. What do you want to stay? Five nights at Freddy's. If you play Five Nights at Freddy's, I probably watch a YouTube channel if you have one. Shout out to Andy Matronic, I love your videos. You probably won't see this, but I just love him so much, especially when you cut out the bootleg cutters, because that was not phone time, Foxy. And I just hope. Oh, yeah. Um, and, like, for all of the FNAF fans out there, I am, like, on top. If you know, if you go to Montrose, you probably know about me, about me and my best friend's math club. Um, 
So, uh, it's me, my friend Evie, Helen, and EJ. And when we do, and like we do this FNAF club, sometimes we'll talk to each other, sometimes we'll just play, other times we'll like, I don't know, talk about like our plans, because we are going to make some flyers. Um, and like the only rule basically is that you have to know the lore and most uh, and like most of the characters that we'll be talking about like um regular freddy glamrock freddy bonnie monty like all of the regulars like vanny oh and you'll need to know gregory and you also need to know a lot of uh you also need to know a lot of um security breach memes like you're supposed to be on lockdown. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth, dude. I'm listening to music. Don't be shy, go, go, bonanza. Shake it right like a belly dance. That's a meme from. That's like a security breach meme that a lot of people like. Um, And there's this other one Um, that's like, Freddy, you're supposed to be on lockdown. But Vanessa, I'm grabbing it because he has like this hatch in his stomach. For some reason, where Gregory can get in like this. And the squeak and the potato. But at least he won't get killed by Vanny or Mills or all the other. And just so you guys know, I actually am doing like a moon and sun based Halloween costume. So, you might want to see that. Look out. Look out for me, the trick-or-treating queen. Candy, candy, sugar. But this actually is this thing that, like, my head hurts way too much when I just have a little bit of candy, and I don't want my hair to hurt, so. Because it hurts really bad. It hurts for a really long time. So, bye, guys. See you later.